Now I'd like to tie for you a crystal dace. The hook I have in the vise is a standard streamer hook. It is a size 8. And this is 3 extra long. And the thread I'm going to use is black 6 aught 70 denier. And I'm going to attach the thread at the head. And I'm only going to come back one quarter of the way on it. And we're not going to put any body on there. For the underbelly, I'm going to use Pearl GSS. You can use Pearl Angel Hair. And I just popped a, a clump off. And I'm going to tie it in right there at the one quarter mark. And it's okay if it spins around the hook. And I'm going to trim off the front. And I'm going to trim off the front. And all these trimmings I actually save. Put them in a small bag. And I'm going to measure it to length. Let me widen it out here a bit. I'm going to measure it to length and I'm going to break this off so that it doesn't look cut. So I'm just going to pull some of it out of there. Pull that back up to where it should be. And I'm going to secure the GSS. Now I'm going to use craft fur, and this craft fur looks like uh, coyote fur. You can put coyote in there if you'd like. Keep it all natural. And I'm going to take that section of craft fur, leaving those black tips in there if you want. And I'm going to tie that in right there. and secure all of it down. Almost looks like a fox tail on there. Or a coyote tail. Now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna take the spay hackle and I'm gonna tie that in right at that front. And get rid of that excess. Clean up that head there just a bit. And I'm going to take the spay hackle. Whoop, let me get that a little bit tighter. Almost feel it slipping. And I'm going to wind that around. I'm going to pull the hackles try and pull the, all of the barbels to one side and I'm going to wind that and you don't want this light you want it pretty heavy so I'm going to use a lot of the feather and I'm going to stroke them towards the back as I go and it's these are a little difficult because these barbels are so long almost end up winding the barbels in if you're not careful. And I'm going to get my hackle pliers and just grab the end and that will make it a little easier to not wrap the 
barbels in. Then I'm going to wipe the entire feather. And tie that off. Pulling all the hackle towards the back. And pull all of these hackles to the back. And you can see you got a nice dark outer coating on there. And I'm going to clean up the head. And I'm going to cut away a couple. There we go, build up that nose on there good. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a whip finish. I'm going to take 3D eyes and I'm going to place them on the sides. And I'm putting these almost on the hackle itself. And you use your bodkin to line them up. Hold that hackle back. And now I'm going to take my Loon UV Cure and I'm going to get a drop in between the eyes on the top and I'm going to put a drop in between the eyes on the bottom and I'm going to take that and I'm going to take it right over the eyes itself form a nice shaped head here and rotating it as you go will help it to level out and then rotate it to help it to level out and I'm going to take my holographic tape get that leveled out there a bit more I'm going to just zap it quickly with this to freeze it and then put my holographic tape around there and this bounces the UV rays around better. And in a few seconds, it's hard. And I'm going to take my Sally Hansen's and put a light coat over the surface. And here we have a crystal dace. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope that you would subscribe to my channel. Please leave comments, questions, suggestions. And most of all, I thank you very much for watching my videos.